if I'm sitting next to a swimming pool and somebody dives in and she's not too pretty, so I can think of something else. I think of the waves and things that have formed in the water. And uh, when there's lots of people have dived in the pool, there's a very great choppiness of all these waves all over the water. And to think that it's possible, maybe, that in those waves is a clue as to what's happening in the pool. That some sort of insect or something with sufficient cleverness could sit in the corner of the pool and just be disturbed by the waves. And by the nature of the irregularities and bumping of the waves, have figured out who jumped in, where and when, and where, what's happening all over the pool. And that's what we're doing when we're looking at something. Uh, the light that comes out is, is waves, just like in the swimming pool, except in three dimensions instead of the two dimensions of the pool. It's they're going in all directions. And we have an eighth of an inch black hole into which these things go, which uh, is particularly sensitive to the parts of the waves that are coming in a particular direction. It's not particularly sensitive when they're coming in at the wrong angle, which you say is from the corner of our eye. 